Welcome back to the next update of my most recent investment, uh, where we're following on from where we last left off, um, and that was the blue outline of the building before we commenced with the footings. The dig went well. Um, there was discussion about having to possibly do pile foundations due to the drop on the side of the property, as can be seen here in this photo. But uh, thankfully we were able to get away with the standard strip foundations due to the good quality of the ground and all we had to do was make sure that we dug to the invert level of the street. We then brought the block and brickwork up to dam course and poured concrete for the slab. And here we are to date now with all the joists in place for the first floor. And uh, I'll take you for a quick tour now of the ground floor. Walking through the front door, where you'll have a staircase here on your left. To the right we walk into the living room. The stud wall is uh, to be constructed here, which will separate the living room from the utility and downstairs cloakroom, which is here, and this will just have a toilet and basin. Then you walk into the dining room and kitchen, and here's the utility with a side door. Uh, all the stud work is pretty much in place for the ground floor. It is structural stud work which is holding up the joists as uh, calculated by our structural engineer. And the next stage now is to take the block work up to the second lift. So just to let you know as well, um, our next investor day will be on the 2nd of June which is a Friday between 10 and 12 again. So if you're interested to learn a bit more about property uh, or track the progress on this one in particular, then please send me a direct message on Facebook and um, I'll give you the details for the address. Speak to you soon.